this workout video, I'm using the TerraCore and a long resistance band. This is going to be interval training, 45 seconds working and 20 second break recoveries. So grab your TerraCore, grab your band and some water and let's get started. For the first exercise, we're doing a staggered stance overhead shoulder press. Keep the abdominals tight and the back straight. To modify this, do alternating single arms. Watch your balance. Get your body position, find your balance, bring the arms up and begin. Exhale, extend both arms up overhead and then with the controlled motion, bring it down. This move is definitely going to test your balance and stabilization. So keep the abs tight and the back straight. You're doing so great, keep it up. You're almost done. Exhale on the way up, inhale when those arms come down. Find a focal point and stick with it. You're almost there. Keep it up. Last three, two, one, and stop. For this next exercise, let's do alternating front lunges. When you step forward, make sure your foot lands in the center of the dome and then push up with that heel to come back to standing. Okay, let's get ready and make sure that you're standing far enough away so that your foot can land in the center of the dome without too much of a stretch. Get ready and begin. Alternating front lunge, push off with that front heel and then back to stand. Plant those feet together before you move the other leg. Also make sure that you're standing up nice and tall and keeping the back straight. Your balance may be tested as well, so keep a focal point straight ahead of you. Continue with that great form. You have three, two, one, and stop. The next exercise is a wide grip row with the same staggered stance we just finished with. Okay, get ready, get your position, and let's begin. Exhale, bring those arms up, and think about squeezing those shoulder blades together on the top end of the movement. And then with control, bring those arms down. Good, you've got it, keep it up. Keep the abs tight. And even though you're hinging forward, keep that back nice and flat. Keep focusing on that balance. You're almost done. Stay with it. Three, two, one, and stop. Here we go with some up and overs. For this one, we're going to pulse the squat twice and then press off with the heel on the dome and go up and over the top. To modify this, remove the pulse and go up and over without too big of a jump. You can also turn the TerraCore vertically and shorten the movement. Pick a side to begin with. Here we go, pulse, and then press over the top. It's a very tiny pulse, but enough so that you'll feel just a bit of heat in those legs. Land with soft feet and soft knees, and also keep that chest lifted the whole time. Your options to bring this low is to remove the pulse and just go over the top with a smaller hop, or you can turn your bench vertically and go over the top on the shorter side. Come on, last few seconds. Stick with it for three, two, one, and stop, you did it. Continuing with that staggered stance, let's do some bicep curls. Stand on top and keep the elbows nice and tight and curl the arms up and down. 
get ready and begin. Curl those arms up and then with control, lower it down. And just like before, watch your balance. Keep your feet firmly planted on top of the dome. Exhale on the curls. Inhale when those arms come down. Focus on keeping the elbows tight and standing tall on top of the dome. Good, keep it up. Remember to breathe. Remember, focus on something in front of you to help with the balance. You're almost there. Last three, two, one, and stop. Let's do lying down chest presses. Lie down on top of the dome and place a handle in each hand. From here, we're gonna go ahead and bring both arms down, inhaling, and then exhale, press the arms up towards the ceiling. To modify this, do alternating arms. Okay, get into position and let's begin. Exhale, extend those arms up to the ceiling or sky and then with control, bring it down. Even though you're lying down in the dome, still keep the core engaged to support the lower back. Focus on the movement and keep your balance on top of the dome. You're doing so good. Maintain the good form and remember your modification if you need to with alternating arms. You're almost there. Last three, two, one, and stop. The next exercise is bulldog jumps. Placing your hands near the front of the dome, you're going to jump your feet up and down. Keep the core engaged and the back nice and flat. Here's a side view so you can see the form. To modify this, remove the jump and stagger your legs up and down, making sure that your toes land in the center of that dome. And just like before, keep the abs tight and the back flat. Let's get into position. Place your hands on top of the dome, keep the core engaged, and begin. Jump those feet up and bring it down. Try to stay nice and light on those toes, keeping the knees bent and the core engaged. Remember, you can modify this by alternating your feet up and down and removing the hop. This one looks easy, but it will definitely get the heart rate up quickly. Come on, stay with it. Make sure those feet land right in the center of the dome. Almost there. In three, two, one, and stop. For this core move, flip the dome over. We're doing a teeter top plank with an alternating knee drive in and out. Keeping the core engaged, teeter top the dome forward and back, and then stabilize center, bringing the knees in and out. Remember to breathe through this entire movement. Place your hands on the handles and assume a high plank position. Okay, you ready? And let's start. Teeter tot forward and back. Bring the knees in and out. Try your best to keep the hips stabilized and the core engaged. This move is definitely a lot harder than it looks. You've got this, keep it up, go nice and slow. The farther that you can tip the dome forward and back, the more challenging it is. Come on, you've got this, almost done. We're going for three, two, one, and stop, you did it. Let's work the abs. Go ahead and take a seat on top of the dome and we're going to do windshield wipers up and down. 
bringing those legs into a rainbow arch and tapping the heels on the ground. To modify this, stagger the legs up and down. Get into position with those legs together. Ready? And let's start. Bring those legs all the way up and down like a windshield wiper. Tap the heels down and then bring it back. Remember, you can always modify this by staggering your legs. You will definitely feel this in your abs as you keep going. Try to maintain good form and keep bringing those legs up nice and high. Breathe, exhale, lifting those legs up, inhale when they come down. Last few seconds right here. Three, two, one, and stop. Good job. Thank you for doing this workout. Remember to like this video and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Also, check out my Instagram at AliFitATL. See you next time.